Hello everyone, today in this video we'll be discussing the AIML super important problems and solutions each uh, module wise and in the first module what are the super important questions and the uh, solutions which uh, which can be asked for 8 to 10 marks the most two important are A star and A O star the remaining ones uh, th that will be discussed in the uh, theory video where I'll be explaining the theoretical concepts regarding what is the algorithm you have to write because see observe the pattern here what they have asked apply the A O star algorithm for the following uh, graph and find the final path okay so uh, you may not get the full marks if you just write the path why because it's for 10 marks and finding out the path is just two or three step process so you have to write a few words regarding the algorithm as well if you don't want your marks to get cut so how to write the algorithm how to remember those points I've discussed in the theory video you can watch that and the link is in the description box for this document as well as the uh, all the uh, previous questions uh, videos link so uh, make sure you watch that one and in this video I'll be discussing what is a star and what is a star how do you apply this a star and a star uh, for these two problems and uh, if they ask an exam what are the same steps you need to follow so before starting make sure you hit the like button subscribe to my channel for more videos like this i'll make up more videos like this for you and without wasting any more time let's get started this is the type of the question which you can expect here so uh, let me explain you there are the nodes here there's a starting node and this is the goal node okay and these are what these are the adjust cost if you want to pass from s to a you have to pay four and if you reach a you have to pay 12 okay this is known as the heuristic values okay so that is already discussed in the theory so here mainly what you have to first focus upon is you are starting from here okay and then you are going to either a or b you have two options right so if i ask you which is better one either uh, going from s to a is better or uh, going from s to b is better by your calculation what you have to first do is you have to calculate 4 plus 12 what is 4 plus 12 16 okay so we'll be writing here 16 16 is the uh, um, cost which we are occurring if you are going from S to A. Okay, anyways, uh, this is the cost which is 16 here. And then we are, if you are going from S to B, at that time what will be the cost? 3 plus 11 which is 14. If you consider 16 and 14 which is smaller, 16, uh, 14, right? So 16 we have got one cost and 14 we have got one cost, okay? So which we will be considering? This one we will be considering. Why? Because this is lesser. After we have considered one, we will be drawing some uh, indicator here to indicate what uh, line we are following. So we will be uh, checking up this one. Okay. Then from here also I have two more paths which is B to C and B to E. Okay. Now what you have to do is, if you are going from B to E, how you will calculate the total cost? From uh, B to E, you to choose this path, right? So you will have to go from this, you will calculate 3 plus 7 plus 6 okay you're going from b to a right you will not consider 11 that is already done in the previous problem here you'll just consider this point which is 3 plus 7 plus 6 what is 3 plus 7 plus 6 this is 16 right so if you reach till here it is coming as 16 so let's have a, a note of that this 14 became 16 okay till here we have 16 okay again we are comparing this 16 or this 16 both are equal so since we have reached far from here we will be considering this one and moving on further if you consider this one and move on further what uh, we will be finding out is from here we have uh, 2 and uh, yeah that's the only path we can have uh, we can just go here so suppose we go here what will be the cost 3 plus 7 plus 2 plus 4 okay what will be again that will be 16 only right so we'll keep it as such and we'll be considering this path here and we'll be moving further so this is the 16 which is same as previous one till here as well so since there is no change happening i'm not going to make any change but if some change happens then i'll let you know what uh, you have to actually do okay so you have come till here that is also 16 cost then from here there are uh, just one part this is actually from a you are coming okay you can't go back here so uh, there will be arrows also given so don't worry about that from here you have to go to the goal set and what will be the cost including 5 is here right so what will be the cost 3 plus 7 plus 2 plus 5 what is that 10 uh, 11 12 12 plus 5 17 and this is 0 so 70 plus 0 is 17 so final cost you got here is 17 that will keep down okay which is the blue path that is 17 uh, cost now what we'll be doing is we'll be checking up the other ones also like had we gone in this way we would have got smaller or not we have to check all the possibilities okay so 3 plus uh, 10 plus 5 what is that the 3 plus 10 is uh, 13 13 plus 5 is um, 18 right 18 is still greater than this we can't consider that so if you had gone like this 4 plus 12 plus 5 what is 4 plus 12 plus 5 more than 21 4 plus 6 plus 16 that is obviously more than uh, 20 that is 26 okay so our shortest path we got as 17 and that's what you have to write the shortest path in the final answer your final answer will be as follows 
your final answer will be as follows you'll be writing the path from s b e c g and the cost is totally uh, 17 like that you have to write okay so this was about the a star you just have to check all the possibilities from the starting and then you have to keep on going okay and choose the least possibility but you have to explore all the parts again okay? so that was about the a star moving on to the ao star quickly this is the question paper question so if i show you here this is the question paper question apply AO star for the following path and find the final path okay so this same uh, thing i have redrawn here so this is for your convenience i have redrawn here the main thing what you have to observe here is that you have and also here okay what is the speciality of and all all the things we'll be discussing okay so see here what are the thing you can find in the purple color that is nothing but the heuristic cost and what are the uh, adjust values that is given here as one so uh, the first step what you have to do is to find out the answer for this one start from a now you are considering from a you can uh, if and is present you have to go for both okay b and c you have to go okay and if a is present here and choosing this path you have to go for both c and d okay like that and is present if and is not there like for example b you can either go to e you can either go to f our goal state is reaching any of these final nodes that is our goal state okay so from a you can uh, go to b and c or you can go to c and d let's see how much cost it happens if you're going from a to b at that time what is the cost one plus three that is equal to four so let's uh, note it down here the cost um, coming here is uh, four four plus you have to do 1 plus 4 1 plus 4 is, is 5 5 plus 4 is 9 so total cost is 9 if you are coming from this path right see 1 plus 3 plus 4 plus 1 that is 9 that is the uh, one path here another path is one, uh, this one and this one both you have to consider 4 plus 1 5 5 plus 5 10 10 plus 1 11 here i got 11 okay like that you have to write and keep next what we have i can choose the uh, least one so i'll be choosing this one and then i'll be going further if i choose this one i have to uh, check from here which is the least path from here what i got 5 plus 1 okay 5 plus 1 is um 6 so uh, here i have written as 3 okay but i am getting here as 6 so i have to replace this 3 with 6 so that's what i'll be doing here i'll be replacing this 3 with 6 okay Six is the cost I've got from here. And from here, what I got? Seven plus one, eight. Obviously, six and eight, what is the least cost? The least cost is six. So I'll be considering six only. And from here, again, I'll be updating back. Okay, once you got, you have to update back also. Okay, after you have got this one, you have to update back means six plus one, seven. Instead of nine, I'll be writing here seven. The new cost, which I've got, seven plus, I have to do this one. Four plus one, five. Seven plus five is um, 12. Okay, so the final cost I've got is 12 here. Okay, like that you have to write and keep. And uh, since I've got the uh, 12 here from the final path, and here I have uh, still the options left, right? I have 11 here, so I'll be choosing uh, which is the smaller path from here. For here, I have to choose both the paths. So what I will do, 4 plus 1, 5, and 4 plus 1, 5, 5 plus 5 is 10. So I've written already 5 here. So I have to cut it and write it as 10. Okay, so I'll be cutting and writing here as 10. Okay, this is the thing I've got from here. 10 and plus 1 what I have that is uh, 11 right so from here I am getting 11 also I have, consider, I have to consider this one so 4 plus 1 is 5 5 plus 11 is 16 so instead of this 11 I will be writing there as 16 okay so obviously you can see which is the shortest path that is nothing but uh, 12 path right so in the answer you have to write the following from A we can go to B then I can go to E that is one path and second path is uh, C AC okay that is the final path you have to write for the AO star and that's what uh, marks the end of this um, pro uh, problem and uh, that's all for this video make sure you hit the like button subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one